close here and I use a program called WinSCP you're gonna need Wi-Fi at home now let's see go to the iPod okay then settings Wi-Fi turn the Wi-Fi on okay we go in here okay so I'm connected now to my Wi-Fi and then look here if you press this little arrow next to the Wi-Fi it's gonna show you the IP address I'm not gonna show you mine because it's confidential or whatever so you type in here the IP address 192 Okay, after you typed in the IP address, you have to put in your username, it's going to be root, and the password is always going to be alpine. Okay, so you, then you log in. Yes. Okay, so here are the files of my computer, and this is my iPod. So... Here, I'm going to go to where I saved my ROM from the poker. So you go in here, the unzip file, unzip file. This one here. And here, see poker GBA. You grab, and, oh no, not yet, not yet. You have to go in media. And here, there's not going to be any folder, but you have to, any folder called ROMs. So you have to, like, right click and put a new new directory. I've already done that. And call it ROMs. Then you have to do a new directory and call it GBA. Like this. Here are all the things, all my ROMs. So here, you grab the poker, drag it here. Okay, copy. We wait to... Okay, so as you can see, the file has already gone through. Here's the poker. Now, what you have to do is put in a file called GBA BIOS in your GPS phone uh, system. So, to get that BIOS, the GBA BIOS, uh, you have to go to a special site that's on my... You just click more info on the right column of the YouTube page, and you come here, applications, look for GPS phone, and here there's going to be a huge list of things. So you just, just grab the GBA BIOS, drag it over here. Make sure not to replace any files. Just copy, ready, when it's really fast. Now you just refresh. Just refresh many times. You can just close this. Now let's go to my 